Hey, welcome back to the show, Dr. David Klein of the Stages of Life. The Stages of Life Institute is located in Longwood, Florida, an easy drive from this area. But even better than that, you can contact them on the web. You can get a lot of lessons on the web. And it seems like every week, every two weeks, there are new things showing up. And soon it's going to be wild. Plus, you can use the Stages of Life portal. That is so cool. I want you to look into that. If you need more information, uh, we'll make it available uh, on the website. Absolutely. Stages of Life Portal. And it's also an app on your phone. It is so, so cool. Doc, we want to talk today about, we've talked all week about supplements. We talk so much about nutraceuticals. Because you'll not only prescribe things for your patients, but you'll sometimes say, instead of that, use this over the counter, as long as it's an effective one. I love that. So we're going to talk about you can never underestimate the cost factors when it comes to supplements. You've got to use your money wisely. Well, let's figure this thing out. Okay, what are the costs? Okay, you have to understand that it's not all about what you pay, but it's all about what you might not be paying. So let's think Mm. this one through for just a second. Okay, so the first time, as a 50-year-old that you go into the doctor's office and your blood sugar's elevated, Whoops. Okay, they can give you any number of things to lower your blood sugar. But you're going to be paying increased premiums in your health insurance for the rest of your life. You really want to talk about an expense? That's a good one. What about cholesterol? You've got elevated cholesterol. That means you're at increased risk for stroke. Your life insurance premiums go up. What about those sleep medications? What about the antidepressants that you're taking as prescription items? Your disability premiums go up. What's interesting about supplements is that they don't appear on anybody's radar. So you can, you can treat, you can control blood sugar, you can control diabetes, you can control uh, depression, insomnia, you can control many, many illnesses, prevent them in most circumstances, and thereby save these individuals a ton of money in insurance premiums. And let's interject for people who haven't heard all of our shows. A lot of people don't understand that a big part of this Affordable Care Act was to make everything that the doctor prescribes for you and every analysis outside of nutraceuticals a record that everybody now can access. It Insurance is all Insurance companies, fair. hospitals, everybody. So... Ten years ago, well, if I don't mention this, it never happened. Now it doesn't matter. It happens all the time. Every, Everything. Every bit of it, okay? And many medications really will seem rather innocuous to you. You know, you're going to go back and say, well, you know, it was given to, me, given to me for free at the pharmacy. Therefore, the economic implications are zero. It isn't so at all. So I prefer to look at things a little bit differently. You might be spending 10 or $20 a month. And saving five or six hundred dollars per month in insurance premiums, and this has nothing to do with the fact that your health is improving. So when you're looking at the cost effectiveness of what you're doing, you need to understand that it's not just about longevity, it's not just about your feeling better, but there's also an economic impact that you don't see. So let's take folic acid as an example. So we've got individuals that will end up with hardening of the arteries. They'll end up with angina. They'll end up with claudication. They'll end up with calcium scores that would suggest that they're at increased risk for heart attack. You can reverse a good bit of this with high doses of folic acid. You can reverse a good bit of it with appropriate omega-3 fatty acids. You can reverse many of the ravages of diabetes, pre-diabetes, by taking things such as vanadium, chromium, alpha-lipoic acid, and right on down the line. If you know what to do, how to do it, take these things in the right combinations. So if you really want to watch your pocketbook diminish... Okay, if you really want to see this happen, watch your health insurance premiums go up the first time somebody gives you a statin for your cholesterol. Okay, now all of a sudden you're going to be in store for sticker shock, especially when the inevitable occurs, which is your employer changes insurance policies, changes companies. Now all of a sudden, there's the etch-a-sketch moment. Everything changes. Now your bill goes up. What was the big complaint some years back, not too many years back, when Obamacare kicked in? My health care premiums tripled. How could this happen? What's so affordable about it tripling? 
Well, for starters, that's Washington arithmetic. Things get more expensive. They therefore become more affordable. I'm not sure that I understand it. I grew up in Washington. It didn't make any sense to me there. doesn't make any sense to me now. But be happy. It's now more affordable because you're paying three times as much or four times as much. Now, how do you avoid this? The way that you avoid this, okay, is by trying to reduce the prescription medications you're taking, substitute supplementation if you know how to do this, okay, and thereby reap the benefits of it. Much of the damage is already done, okay? If you're sitting back taking Crestor, my God, you know, that $100 a month didn't hurt you too bad, but the insurance premiums certainly do. <laughs> Antidepressants, every bit is bad. Can you control depression in most individuals with supplementation? The answer is, of course you can. 5-hydroxytryptophan, L-theanine, melatonin. You restore sleep, most of the depression symptoms go away. How do you deal with uh, you know, ocular issues, paying attention to taurine, vanpacete, and huprazine. These things, many of them used to be prescription. Our, our brothers and sisters in Europe, many of them can't get this stuff because their leftist governments have already taken them away. Ours are trying to vote them out of office. That's just Whoa. my little suggestion there. Very good. You know, I have found on the nutraceuticals that you've got me on that I'm feeling better, coming out of things a little bit, Every now and then when I do backtrack, I have to look at my list and say, what did I run out of? Well, okay, N-acetylcysteine, N-A-C, okay, used to be a prescription item. It was useful to treat children with cystic fibrosis. It was one of the few things that you could do to get the junk out of their lungs. Well, guess what? It's over the counter now. Okay, did it stop working? Did it stop working because it's over-the-counter? Well, it became over-the-counter because it was found to be very, very safe. This is true of lots and lots of these medications. Most of them, many of them, are simple amino acids. And you're going to go, well, gee, if, I, if it's a matter of protein, how much do I need? Well, these amino acids do far more than build protein. They build enzymes. They are, in many cases, used as energy transfer uh, proteins and so on and so forth. So it's not all about structure. It's not all about building muscle. But much of what's going on is about pure physiology. You know, inositol is a sugar. Why does it lower your blood sugar when you take it? Mm -hmm. Because it hits something called sirtuin-1, okay, which is a, an odd little protein. What about AMPK? So we're giving people things like berberine, which is an herb, over the counter, it will cut your triglycerides in half. Okay, I don't know of a pharmaceutical that'll do that. Okay, what else does it do? It lowers weight. What a bummer. You know, so many of these things have multiple uses if you understand several things. One, you don't have to pay a lot of money to get the quality. Right. You do need to get quality, you know, to, for it to work. So there's a dose relationship. There's a moiety relationship. There's a timing relationship. And oddly enough... Different people have different needs. Go figure. Okay, so strontium. If you want to take something for osteoporosis, preventing osteoporosis, treating osteopenia, strontium citrate. Mm -hmm. Okay, we'll start. You'll start seeing reverses on your on your Z scores within six weeks. Okay, do you necessarily have to take a bisphonate? No, it's a poison. Take your strontium. Take your vitamin K two. Take your vitamin D three. Guess what? What about those happy individuals with atrial fibrillation? Okay, coenzyme Q10 is used for this. You take your CoQ10 in sufficient dosage, and very frequently you get it under control as long as you're taking what you're supposed to take. What about preventing cataracts? You know, the Chinese wow. actually figured this out with something called taurine. Now, here in Florida, the good news is we don't have cataracts here. <laughs> okay, that the, the sunlight is killing the lens in your eye. Okay, yeah. it does it through UV, uh, UV component. You're supposed to wear your sunglasses. Many people don't. Touring. So these supplements are extraordinarily efficient in what they do. If you're buying them properly, they're very, very cost effective. And what you want to avoid, and remember this underscore bold italicize as follows. If it says proprietary blend of, keep it on the shelf. It's probably garbage. There's only one reason to make something proprietary mm -hmm. blend of, and that's that it was not assayed, which means low quality. Okay, that's the good news. The bad news is they're telling you, hey, we don't want to tell you what's in it because you're going to find out this isn't a good value. If it says good. proprietary blend, it's probably junk. Now, is that always true? Nothing's always the case. That one's pretty darn close, you know? So if it says proprietary blend of, leave it alone. It is probably not a good 
value, probably not a good cost-effective treatment. Now, we know that the products in the nutraceutical store at the stages of life are all assayed. You can ask all the questions you want, and if you understand the writing, you can just read those things and know what's in everything that you have in the selection, okay? It's also very easy to see what you might use because everything is in a section by what it does. Very, very cool, okay? Not complicated at all. The stages of life, and Robin, how do we make a connection? All right, our phone number is 407-679-3337, and our website is stagesoflife.net. We're located in Longwood at 1917 Booth Circle. That's right off of I-4 and 434. And uh, let's see, our office hours are Monday through Thursday, 8 to 5. The health store that Rob mentioned with all of our nutraceuticals is open during those office hours, but we're also on the web, as I said, at stagesoflife.net, and you can purchase your nutraceuticals at your leisure, and we will ship them to you.